In this video, I'm going to show you how to count the number of times something occurs inside an array or a string. So let's say we want to count the number of times the letter A occurs inside this array. The first step is to have a variable called count, and count is set to zero. The second step is to traverse through the array, starting at index zero. So we see that here we have A. We increment count to one, we go to the next letter, we see it's B. We move to the next one, it's C. And the next one, we see that we have A again, so we increment count to 2. We move to the next element, it's D. And next, it's A, so count becomes 3. And then we move to the next one, and it's E. So at this point, we're at the end of the array, and we know that the letter A occurred 3 times in this array. Let's take a look at the code in Python. So here is our list. We're going to call the method count occurrences. We're going to pass in our list and we want to count the number of times the letter A occurred inside the list. And here is our method. We take in the list and then the value that we want to count. The first step is to set count equal to zero. Then we traverse through the list. If the element that we're at is equal to the value, then we increment count, and at the very end of the for loop, we simply return the count. The runtime is all of n because we just traverse through the loop once, and the space is all of 1 because we're not creating any new space. And that's basically it for today. I hope you found this video helpful, and I hope that you enjoyed my video. If you want to see more of my computer science videos, go ahead and click on the data structure playlist here on the screen, and don't forget to subscribe and share with your classmates to help them as well.